Hello. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do so by clicking on the subscribe button below. Hello. This is Barry Nirmal. In this video, I will tell you how I painted the storm door of my house. This storm door has a frame that is made of metal and the, uh, the metal had become dull and the paint had become old so I painted it with a new uh, paint and it looks gorgeous. I will tell you all the steps I took to paint this uh, door including all the paints that I used. Thank you. So I bought this, um, this paint, it's called Rust Oleum Hammered Paint. The color is copper. This is written on the uh, top of the can. And uh, at the bottom it says, hides surface imperfections. No primer needed. So to use this paint, I did not have to use any primer. Also, I used the gloves in both hands while painting and I bought this, uh, this box of gloves from Harbor Freight for cheap and I used two brushes, one wide and one narrow. The narrow brush is used uh, at the corners or at the narrow edge of the, um, of the, of the place and the wide one is used for quick painting of a wide uh, surface. Mm -hmm. So th th it's very important that I use this, uh, this paint. It's called hammered. Hammered is just a, a look of the paint. It means that the final paint, after it dries, will appear as if somebody has hit the surface with hammer. It gives a very distinctive look to the paint. And uh, this paint comes in many colors, including black, gold, silver, and white. However, in the, uh, in the spray form, the white color is available, but in the can, it's only available in black, gold, silver, brown, and copper, not in white. I prefer to use the can because it's economical and also I find it's better if I use a brush to paint because when I spray I have to protect the, the neighboring surface with uh, masking tape and there's more work involved whereas to paint this door I did not have to use any masking tape or called painter's uh, masking tape. I just use the brushes that I'm showing you and uh, after I painted the whole uh, the whole door I just threw out the uh, the uh, the paint brushes in the garbage uh, but you can clean it by using uh, paint thinner as uh, described on the on the box I also painted the lock and the door knob which is on the inside door and I also painted this uh, this uh, this knocking thing I put a piece of uh, piece of paper under the knocker uh, so that I could just use a brush and paint the knocker I did not have to remove the knocker and uh, from inside also I painted as you can see uh, you can, from inside also and uh, uh, so this storm door has been painted from inside uh, or, or, and as well as outside and uh, and the handle you can see the handle on the storm door the handle previously was very bad it had some glue type of thing on it which I cleaned as much as I could before painting however even if I didn't do a thorough job of cleaning it looks quite decent after painting so uh, so that this this storm door looks great from inside and also outside uh, so uh, so this is how it looks uh, from outside 
and uh, it's all the way from top to bottom you can see you can see and I also painted on the side the wood uh, um, the wood on, on the on the on the side with the same paint so that it gives a nice look and also this paint is very very thick and very uh, uh, very strong it will protect the wood also uh, so that for years to come the wood will not decay uh, so uh, so you can see the wood on the top and the metal on the top also I painted and uh, so it looks uh, great it looks great you can see and uh, you can use this paint to paint on any metal uh, like wheelbarrow, wheelbarrow or any metal which you you leave outside uh, or inside so that uh, it's basically it will not get rusted. That's why it's, it's basically to prevent rust on metallic objects. One more thing, this paint can be used on metal without any primer. However, if you want to use this paint on plastic or uh, plastic, you should use a primer first so that the primer will stick on the, plast on the plastic nicely and then you use this paint. What I would recommend is this paint. It's called Zin Sir Bull's Eye 123 Primer for all surfaces. It says this primer is water-based, interior and exterior. And I uh, have used this uh, primer to prime the, uh, the bath, uh, in the bathroom. I used it on, uh, on shower uh, to paint the uh, the bottom of the shower. I used this primer first at the bottom of the shower and then I used a, a paint on top of it. Hello, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please do so by clicking on the subscribe button below. You should also share this video with your friends by clicking on the share button below. You can share it via WhatsApp, via Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or via email. Please also write your thoughts in the comment section below so that others may benefit from your thoughts. You can also click on the bell icon so that you will be informed when I post new videos. Thank you.